The word for today, focus on what matters. Don't get sidetracked, Proverbs 4, 27. Many of us fail to move forward, not because we aren't talented, determined, or passionate, but because we get sidetracked. God told the prophet Habakkuk, write the vision and make it plain on tablets, that he may run who reads it, Habakkuk 2, verse 2. Unless you have a clearly defined goal and keep it before you at all times, you won't run in the direction you should. As motivational speaker and author Sam Horn said, it's hard to stay on purpose if we don't know what our purpose is. In his book, One Big Thing, Phil Cook writes, I've never been a fan of the person who invented the open door policy. Sure, we want to be accessible to employees and to co-workers, but at some point it's time to shut the door and to get to work. After your next interruption by a visitor, make a note of how long it takes to get back to your previous level of intensity and focus. You'll be shocked at how much time that steals from your day. Too often other people's needs come before our dream. Obviously, we need to care for our children, honor our spouses, and to deal with our primary responsibilities around our families or jobs. But the first step in achieving our dream is to take responsibility for it. That means scheduling it and unscheduling the lesser needs of co-workers and friends. These daily commitments chip away at our time, and before long, our dream gets lost in the shuffle. Stop doing what other people think is urgent and start focusing on what matters to you and to God.